everybody, and welcome to Larry's Country Diner. Oh, we've got a show for you today. You do not miss one moment. All right now, I want to introduce a man who Watch humble out. beginnings in the food business. Watch out. He was selling hot dogs out of a truck. One day he ran out of mustard, and he said, there's got to be more than the food business than this. And now look at him. Look at all. <laughs> it's Larry! <laughs> you know, this guy has nightmares the night before we do these I things. I do, and write so them down. So you can figure that out, yeah. <laughs> Here's the promise, 2 Thessalonians 3.3. 3. But the Lord is faithful, who shall establish you and keep you from evil. And then I show up and there's Keith. <laughs> <laughs> now that was nasty, wasn't it? It was nasty. Yes, I see. Didn't say anything like about not boy. being nasty. All right, Keith, this is for you. Okay. Which is correct to say, the yolk of the egg are white or the yolk of the egg is white? It's yellow. <laughs> Good. Wow. That's the right answer. <laughs> <laughs> ben whispered me the answer. Yeah, right. <laughs> Well, Ben had it right. Been there, done that. Ah, I got that. <laughs> I gave you credit for it. It is great to have with us the Isaacs. Yes. <laughs> All right, now, we used to have four Isaacs. Well, there's still four of us. I see one, two, three, four, Larry. Uh huh. Uh, Plus. And then I see oh, five, you're talking six, about the band. seven. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. We've and the way I territory. was looking back here, yes. I didn't see the steel guy, Yeah. but I saw the sheet music. And I leaned over and I talked, I said to Keith, Keith, look at there, something's wrong here. The drummer's the only one that has sheet music. <laughs> <laughs> and I just let him go on thinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's get a song out of you. Crank sure, this thing up here. Sure, uh, we're ready. Y'all ready? Here's one everybody can help us sing. One. to see in my way Do I have to keep on talking till I can't go on Why you see it your way Run the risk of knowing that our love may soon be gone We can't work it out We can't work it out Think of what you're saying You can get it wrong and still you think that it's alright Think of what I'm saying Work it out and get it straight or say goodnight We can work it out, we can work it out Life is very short and there's no time For fussing and fighting, my friend I have always thought that it's a crime Isaacs, we can work. I like that. 
Thank you. We wrote that. No, I'm kidding. No, Sonia. <laughs> you wish. I wish. You don't hear a lot of Beatles music on the diet, right? No, but that's all right. We, we haven't had the Beatles yet either. Oh, yeah, that's well. true. I'm we working have on that. The Isaacs, we have them. That's right. Oh, that's Ringo back, back there on the drums. Isn't Ringo, it? Ringo's Oh, I know. It's Mike. You know what? Let's take a break here and we'll be right back. Oh, you want to take a break? Okay, let's take a break right here. He said so. Larry's Country Diner. We'll be back. Nadine's going to join us. And welcome back to Larry's Country Diner. Larry, you going to eat this? I mean, it's just You stay here. away from my fork. Oh, is that yours? Well, I don't that, when you come to the fork in the middle of the road, doesn't mean you take it. Oh. Well, I can do it with my fingers here. That's right. <laughs> Here's Larry, by the way. You know what? Let's see if we can get Nadine cooked up and ready to go. Uh-oh. Here comes trouble. Well, you don't know. There she is. The door works. Hi, you. I just watched that wall. One of these days when you shut that door, everything's going to fall off yep. the wall. <laughs> no, you just can't find good construction workers these days. Hey, not, not to make them set it up like that. How's Isaac's doing? Great. We're great. Y'all look so cute. You look cute, <laughs> too. Smiles. You look cute, too. We love you. We love you, too. Aww. My split personality loves both, all y'all. Got <laughs> that. Uh, you know, where's my coffee? I'm coming. <laughs> what I've demanding had, yeah. I've had six cups today I'm about ready to climb the ceiling <laughs> Oh you climbed the wall The ceilings I know well, I See I, I'm just ooh. The caffeinated coffee It's like hairless cat It exists uh, but regular. It's against the regular wall <laughs> Is that caffeinated uh, coffee? No thank goodness That's my seventh one <laughs> Uh, I do not like caffeinated, uh, decaffeinated coffee. What's the point? I know. I don't yeah, understand that either. Yeah, that's what it's called. Either. What's the point? Yeah. No, that's, that's the church that I'm going to start. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> they have North Point, West Point, Central Point. I'm going to go, what's the what's point? The, what's the point? Perfect. <laughs> they got Cross Point. What? They have Cross Point. Cross Point? Yeah. What's the point? Somebody asked me the other day what inspires me to get out of bed every morning. And? It didn't take me long to say, well, my bladder, mainly. Yeah. <laughs> you, you know uh, that just re replacing potato chips with grapefruit, you can lose 90% of the whole joy you've ever had at this stage. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. And why is it that eggs come in a flimsy styrofoam carton and batteries come in a package that you've got to use a chainsaw on to open? It's a good question. See, I've had six cups today. Yeah. My mind is just going we crazy. Can tell. Yep. Me and Renee was talking. You could, you could survey 100 people our age, and I bet two people could tell you their blood type, but every one of them would know the theme to Beverly Hillbillies. <laughs> Did you know that? I'm listen to I'm B plus. Do you know it? What? You're B plus? Yeah. I, mean, I learned that when everybody's getting COVID. Mm. And the people that had B plus. They said we're the last ones to get it. Oh, I thought it was O. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> I never heard of B plus. Maybe I'm O plus. I had not either. <laughs> what? Is there a B plus? A B positive. A B positive. B positive. Well, that's a plus. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't have a minus by it. <laughs> we're always telling you to be positive. You that's ought to right. remember that. <laughs> there are three kinds of men. The ones that learn by reading, a few who learn by observation, the rest have oh, to I pee know. on the electric fence and find <laughs> out for themselves. I like that one. Sounds like the voice of experience to me, huh? <laughs> All right. Thank Nadine, you, Larry. I forgot where I was. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I, you know, at this age, I go, I think I'm buying bananas now just to watch them die a slow death in my kitchen. Yeah, there you go. I don't eat them. I just buy them and let them watch them turn brown for some reason. Luann does that, and then she makes banana nut bread. Mm -hmm. I don't have the energy. I, uh, um, what was I going to tell you? <laughs> <laughs> you sound like Larry. Oh, I, I, I spent 30, I, I got 30 minutes of cardio the other morning, 
trying to pick an ice cube up off my kitchen floor. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was going to tell you. That's a great idea. And have you noticed they're putting jokes on snacks now, on the side of snacks? No. They are. They've started doing that. My favorite one is serving size, three cookies. <laughs> Thanks, Ben. No, no, no. <laughs> that was funny. I tell you. Explain that to me. Smartest guy in the room, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I just cleaned out space in my freezer. It sounds much more productive than I just finished off a pint of ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go put the sign up. Already? Yep. Well, no, you know what? I, one more thing I got to tell you. Somebody told me that you know, people our age, we just age like fine wine. That's right. You know what Homer said? What? About me? Cork it. He said, you age like milk, sour and chunky. <laughs> That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did the ambulance come and get him pretty quick? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they did. Real fast. Real fast. I'm going to go over and put it up. You were born to be real. Not perfect. I like that. Last week was so long, it took me forever. And so I thought I'd do a short one this time. Well, that's Randy's. Randy's. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, motto. we're sharp today, aren't we? <laughs> Randy's motto. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and what was it again? <laughs> <laughs> Whew. What time is it? It's time for lunch. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, you were born to be real, not perfect. Yeah. 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 What she said. Yeah. 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 It's about time for some more Isaac music, oh, you think? Please. Thank you so much. We're going to do a song for you that it's a song that my son Levi and my sister and I wrote around uh, May of 2020. And I now, think son that Levi. My son Levi. Yeah. Hi, Levi. Yeah. And her grandson, her first grandson. My oh, first my born grandson. Yeah. And it's a song that we wrote uh, when all, everything had just begun to happen over 2020. And we sat down at the table and we just really tried to count our blessings in yep. spite of what we were all feeling, the isolation and the loneliness. And uh, we had written songs in the past about God's faithfulness on the mountaintop. And we've written songs about God's faithfulness in the valley, but we had never taken the time to write a song about God's faithfulness in the wilderness, that dry and lonely place that we mm. all felt. And that's what this song talks about. Great. But 
You might have to wait And you might have to pray More than you knew you should do And you may be afraid You may have lost your faith In all you ever knew But my God won't lead you where he won't keep you and he'll be You've been through the wilderness when your house burned down. Oh, you got that right. That song touches home. <laughs> so great. Yeah. Oftentimes you learn more in the wilderness. Yeah. I've learned a few things, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> learned who my friends are, like people that get together Listen with to Mike you. Huckabee and do a big benefit. No. And people well, that that's certainly why I brought that up. I want you to know that. Uh-huh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I won't say that anyway. <laughs> no. God gives you a wife to help you with your strength. You got that right. Wow. Okay, let's take a break. We'll be right back. Okay, we will be back. The Isaac's going to sing some more and you don't want to wait. And welcome back to Larry's Country. Checking out the menu today, today's special. It's the Isaacs Praise the Lord and Pass the Gravy Country Fried Chicken. Served with mashed potatoes and blessed before cooking green beans. It'll have you shouting hallelujah. All right, let's get another Isaacs song if we can. Yeah, let's do it. We want to dedicate this song to all the single folk watching and in the house today. I love it when I hear stories of um, people that fall in love later in life for whatever the reason why they still remain single. But uh, we wrote this song. It's called Never Too Late for Love. All right. You've cried through the bad breaks, survived all the heartaches, while time just slipped through.
Yes. I had a friend of mine tell me the other day that his wife said, honey, if, if I passed away, would you remarry? He said, well, it's, it's been such a happy marriage. I wouldn't want to finish my life with, without someone. So yeah, I'd probably remarry. He said, would you, would you let her sleep in my bed? He said, well, it's, it's, it's a good bed. Why would you get rid of the bed? Practical. Would you sell my car? It's a great car. Why, why would I not make use of a car? She said, would you let her use my golf club? So she didn't, she's, she's left-handed. She couldn't use it. <laughs> oh! Oh! Let's get out of here. We'll be right back. Oh! And then they took him to the graveyard. <laughs> we'll be back right after this. You're just in time to hear another Isaac song, but first, there's Larry. All right. If you were running a race and you passed the person in second place, what place would you be in now? Who it's said that? It's a trick question. Yeah. Depends on what, which way they're going. <laughs> <laughs> there's only one way that a race goes, and that's, that's from here to there. See, so you're running in a race. And it, yeah, but you can be passed going forward and back. Oh, I... Don't argue with Ben. He's That's brilliant. right, I'm big. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not smart, I'm just big. If you Amen. were running a race and you passed the person in second place, what place would you be in now? You would be in second. You passed the person in second place, not first. You would be, yeah. Yeah, I mean, duh. yeah, duh. <laughs> Let me explain that to you, Ben. <laughs> Let's get another song out. <laughs> you know our love was meant to be Ooh, the kind of love
to heaven, I'm going to be able to sing like that. <laughs> We're going to sing harmony. We are. Right <laughs> and you guys are our inspiration. We love you oh, all man. so much. Yes, we wrote that. I don't, it's in a Chicago song. Chicago yeah. song? You know that, right? Yeah. 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 Peter Satir? Can I say thank you so much to Scotty Sanders for playing with us today? Yeah. Oh, Mike yeah. Rogers, Levi Bowman, Ben James, thank you yeah. all so much. We love these guys. We're a family. This is our mama, Lily, and uh, we're siblings, Becky, I'm Sonia, and that's Ben. Thanks for having us. We love you. You guys are just incredible. I, we, I love it every time we have an opportunity to have you or be with you. Well, I would like to say also, we're so privileged to travel with Mark Caps, which was Jimmy's son. And so every night at the, uh, at the concerts, people come up. And, uh, of course, we recognize uh, Jimmy for being yep. so wonderful and how much we love him and Michelle. And uh, so we'll wave back and say, how many of y'all know that used to know the sheriff on Larry's Country Diner? And half the crowd raises their hands. And so we love to take Larry's Country Diner everywhere we go and the, and the Caps family. Yeah. Let's get out of here. What else can you say except Larry's Country Diner where the cameras are always rolling and we, we don't, don't care. care. Good stuff. Thank you. <laughs>